Rebels attack a mining guild on Eridus. Brambell Iblis, known terrorist leader, taken into custody. Death Sticks. Are they a sinister plot created by non-human industrial complex? And Champala Freed. All this and more tonight on INN. Hello, I'm Shan Halcard, and here are tonight's top stories. Spotted by the venerable ARC-170 Imperial Patrol craft, former Senator Graham Bell Iblis was put into custody as his warship full of radicals burned over the harsh world of Eridus. The world whose small population is made up of mostly locals and hard-working members of the civilian industrial complex known generally as the Mining Guilds found themselves under brutal attack by a group of unknown assailants, later to be found working under the former senator from Corellia. Is this some kind of Corellian plot to undermine a competitor, or just more violence disguised as lawful rebellion under Mon Mothma's tyranny? Local Imperial Security near the world of Champala released a statement this afternoon condemning the oppressive and draconian laws of the local elected officials whose reign caused undue suffering to the local population. Imperial forces have liberated the capital city and arrested the corrupt government officials in a planet-wide sting operation with limited loss of life. It's widely believed by Imperial Security that the elections of these officials was fraudulent. A temporary Imperial government is being established till the situation stabilizes and a new election can take place. The local MOF has offered Imperial governing as an option if, and we quote, that's what the people would prefer. Only a truly free election can tell, which we will organize in time, of course. An Imperial training operation has taken a dramatic turn as an accident in the Tanab system has claimed the lives of 3,000 local security forces. How? We're unsure at this time as the investigation is still ongoing. Any civilian traffic currently set to pass through this system is to reroute to one of two dozen alternative hyperlanes and hyperbeacons listed under the navigational holonet channels 1406 through 1424. The Imperial Navy has apologized for the inconvenience. After the break, Rana Tain has a special report on the danger of the addictive substance known simply as Death Sticks, and the surprising history on how the substance was created and spread through Imperial worlds to specifically prey on your children. Please stay with us after the break to find out how you can protect your family from the multi-planet non-human pharmaceutical industry. Ladies and gentlemen, Captain Shaq here, and welcome back to Empire War Forces of Corruption. Playing, taking, playing, taking, playing the fantastic mod Awakening the Rebellion. Let's look at the galaxy. Focusing on Jaeger Minor and Anshin. I love that it just keeps focusing on the corridor, it seems like, these days. But welcome back, everyone, to running the Empire and bringing peace at the end of a gun, at the bottom of a boot, as the Empire does. Let's go ahead and pause real quick, turn on all the things, so we can see what's going on in the galaxy. We have, bring the music down just a little bit. Uh, we just built a probe droid, I heard it go off. And we have the Quad Drive Yards has already kicked out our newest Imperial, uh, our newest ISD-1. Nice, nice. Now, I read through your comments. There are a few good pieces of information there. Um, Skako Miner, we need to get the bare bone space station up here because it's a gas giant and we can mine tabana gas from it yeah this planet can build tabana gas refineries that'll be super useful uh and hopefully we can hold it if there's ever a raid we did actually put a small landing platform on it which i could upgrade at some point though this does have maintenance costs and the maintenance costs are yeah it doubles the maintenance cost at 200 credits so we'll probably wait on that we'll wait on that uh we do oh man we're about to get paid too we're about to get paid. We need to get the fleet together. We've got our ISB agents and our security personnel for dealing with any credit theft and spies. Our fleet, oh, speaking of like credit theft and spies, Grildor actually has piracy group operating in the system. We should be able to deal with that. I'm sending the ISB oh, over. One of our Aquintons is finished. Oh, and uh, well, it was at Krildor, wasn't it? Yeah, we have some support craft actually here. We got a ties loaded up into a Gazanti. We've got an, um, an Aquintans ready to go. Let's move our two Vanna gas platforms over. Grab you guys up. And I'm going to have you report to Vader? No, I'm going to have you go to Ferost for right now. Meet there. I'm sending an ISD there as well. I'll even bring the Carrick from here. Uh, some of the plans that we discussed was keep taking over the hyperlanes, kind of figure out where we want to go. 
Uh, when I was looking over this right before I started recording, I realized if we can get through a Roche, which might be a trap because the Hapes might control it. I mean, maybe not. The Hapes are actually back here nowadays. They don't they don't connect directly to the Roche asteroid belt anymore. And I know they don't own Tanab because we're about to invade it. We've got the ground forces ready. Local security forces are being a pain. Um, We might be able to go grab the wheel. That would be hilarious. And well worth it. Mercenary recruiting in these regions. Wait, if there's... If the Black Sun is recruiting mercenaries in this region, then I know who owns it. This is Black Sun territory. They've pushed out from Mandalore. Intriguing. Yeah, I bet the wheel is super defended as well. Though, if we did connect, we could pick up this battle group. Ah, oh, good luck taking that. I should actually, are there any forces here? No, I've already moved them over. Okay, good. Let's get the invasion underway for Tanab. And then we'll figure out where we're going to go next. I have two minutes left on, I think it was Starfighter Tech. I'm pretty sure we started last time. So let's get... Oh, no. No, we're not invading yet. We don't have any troops. We've got a few platoons of regular, or of, um, of stormtroopers, but we don't have any, like... Did I leave you guys back here? I left you on Coralag, didn't I? Uh, no, I don't think I left you on Coralag. I think Priority I actually... Soldiers. Yeah, let's let's uh, let's recruit some more. Oh, and what did I need for? Oh, I need light vehicle tech too. Ugh. That would also get us. Um, no, that should already be a thing. The 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 missile laden ATST. But I would need. Yeah, I would need to go for. We've got the Imperial. Upgrade to large Imperial factory, which would give us the ATPT, the ATSTR. That's the rocket version. There it is. Upgrade That's the investment we're doing. Five grand. Oh, hurts. It hurts. Uh, I should also grab up a bunch of regs. So let's go ahead and Training really pick that up. Troops. And then I want to get the occupier would be really nice to have. 5,000 is not too bad. I'm putting it on Bill Bringy. Tech Bill Bringy is getting, yeah, we'll put it on Bill Bringy because Bill Bringy already has a golden platform uh, and I'll, I could send some troops over there. Oh yeah, infantry like battle line, especially with all these turrets we can pick up. Good luck taking that. And I need to pick this up too. Next, next time. Maybe put a little production on here where we're actually building some of the ground vehicles might not be a terrible idea. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I can't produce a I can produce a light factory. Yeah. All right. Building All right. That's the bill bringy investment, man. I'm um, investing in one planet. So people forget this. They get mad at me because I don't, I don't, I, you haven't built this yet. And look at how much money we've got coming in and how quickly it goes, right? This is why things just take time. You got to wait for it. Uh, Construction complete. All right, Coralag, send your troops over. I can't be waiting. I can't be waiting around. We did actually build you an AT-AT. -AT. You don't have a garrison at all? Whoa. Ready. I hadn't realized we never put a garrison on Balmora. Because we're fighting against the Rebellion, we have to worry about raids constantly. The Rebellion has advanced their tech level. Speaking of worrying about raids, and we don't know what that was. All right, we've got a support team ready to land. Begin the invasion. invasion commencing. And go. And go. Oh, so I got some, some more images of the upcoming development of Republic at Wars, like remake, ready, right? That mod, that classic that. mod is yes, back sir. in the works again. What are your orders? And Choose it looks so good. They've, uh, I got to see a picture of the, the Republic's fleet with the Venator, the Pelta, the um, Aquintans. Uh, and I think I think there was an Acclimator in there too. So basically all the, like the mainstays. Uh, let's go ahead and grab a bunch of regs. Moving on your mark. Moving to that position. And once again, I'll bring in some ties. Ready for orders. Go ahead and move up. 
I'm not gonna waste any money on turrets here. I don't think. Arrival of our field All right, field commanders here. You're gonna be group one. Fly on and let's see what they've got. See if you can stop this. If its health is low enough, I'm gonna back you up this direction and then I'm gonna have you move in and engage. Hey guys, there you go. Come on back in. Miss every shot. You missed. You missed every. Sh it's not, not an anti-air weapon, is it? No, it's not. But you're still missing every shot. Yes, come on. All right, we're moving up. Let's bring in the artillery platforms. Let's bring in some ATPTs to cover them. On my way. The cheapest chips. Heading there now, sir. Army. And then maybe one juggernaut in the back. Oh, that, so there's a trailer. Uh, there's a trailer out for Bad Batch. And it looks, holy crap, look at that impact. Because we can see them. Uh, for Bad Batch, and it looks amazing. It looks so good. Hey, Artie, we've got an almost completed anti-infantry weapon system. Let's split you guys up. I'm gonna put like half of you in here. And then the rest of you, I want you to just kind of hold position. I'm redirecting the ties right now. Artie is out. Good hit. Second hit. Good hit. I need two more shots before they're dead. Odd walkers. Uh, you're looking pretty good. Let's move you up to about right here. Get some shots in. If we can take it out. But yeah, there's a, there's a juggernaut in that, and it looks fantastic. I can't wait to see that. There's the rockets. They even show it firing the rockets from a little rocket pod, which is very, very cool. Uh, I'm seeing a little bit of uh, anti-air. I think so. Let's move you back over here. You can help that. I feel like you could hit a building if you tried real hard. So why don't you try? Uh, and I'm going to get my artillery set to group two so I can coordinate the fire there. Let's take that bunker out. And then we'll move you up here. Infantry eating up the rounds just like we want. Looking good. We're starting to take out the bunker. They're building a flat cannon. So I'm going to have the ties actually engage that. And then group two, let's switch fire real fast. As long as we can kill it before it finishes, we should be able to kill it. Come on, come on, come on. I need those shots. Yes. I need those shots. Fire, fire. Ooh, that right fire rate's real slow. There it is. Did you miss? I think they missed. Rockets are away. Oh, oh if that flat comes online, we are going to lose our ties. Ready to go. All right, pods, you're clear to move up. Ah, oh, there's the hits. Now we're looking good. Okay, pod walkers move in now. See, pod walkers turn up north. Let's deal with this. Let's deal with this. I see you. I see you over there. One of my ties has decided to, like, just stop moving. There he goes. So this isn't actually their main base. This is just a free unit spawn. Okay, you guys are getting a little too deep. Try to take out those anti-infantry turrets, and I'll move the Juggernaut over and redirect some artillery fire that direction. Infantry, how you doing? Uh, casualties are are light. You're fine. Let's go. Just let the ties keep strafing this. Reporting. And then I'll let the bombing run deal with it. Maybe. Uh oh. We're taking way too much anti vehicle fire. Hey, Roger artillery. That. Can you, um. Actually, you're doing fine. Yeah, you're doing fine. You fall back. What are your orders? You move up a little bit. You fire in those rockets. Good grief. I think every shot missed. Let's go. Copy. That would have been way more impressive if you actually managed to hit something. I don't see any kind of jamming weapons. They're falling back. Enemy sighted. Towards the actual base. I can really use a bombing run right now. They're losing numbers quickly. I copy. Form up. You guys are still in range? Yeah, they're still in range. We can move up the support teams. On the move. You guys move up here. Unit destroyed. Oh! Reporting. Is that what I think it is? Yes. Right away. Alright, fall back a little bit. Back. Let's redirect our artillery. Awaiting orders. Onto this target. Yes, sir. Odd walkers move back here. At least until we kill out the um yeah, armor piercing. There's the shots. Good. I love these walkers. These things are great. Yes, I don't think they've picked up any more anti-air. Alright, you guys can re-engage. 
You can re-engage. And you guys take cover? Just hold up there. I might even put you in the tree line. I don't know if this gives a defense bonus. Probably depends on how they set the map up. But I'm going to move you up a little bit closer. I want to be able to see the, the larger group up here. Ah, oh, but I'm so excited for the Republic at War update. Like, that's, it's so cool to see that back into production. There's been an ongoing conversation in in Shack Chat um, about general Star Wars y nonsense. But one of the one of the weird ones is Ready. this they've been talking about like, you know, starships, we've been talking about Republic at War. And the idea that the Venator, my favorite and I'll, I'll, I'm biased for sure. My favorite capital ship. Oop, we're gonna need some artillery back there. We gotta deal with this. So I need as much fire as I can get on this location. Like, let's just detonate this metal group right here. By the idea that the Republic misused it, and that the idea that it's only a carrier. I don't think so. I assume that comes from the idea that you know every opening episode of um, Clone Wars is like some poor Venator getting beat to hell. It's not like they had another ship just ready to go that could do the job better. As like a brawling ship. Right. Okay, we're gonna, oh, there it is. That's the shots. And now we've got the rockets. All right, there's the bombing run. We're going to use this to push through. Bombers are on their way. They're classic ties this time. Wait, why are they classic ties? Isn't Vader in orbit? I wonder why. Well, nice to see the classic tie in the field. Dropping protons. Good hit, too. That should open us up so we can move in now. Targets engaged. Awaiting orders. As you wish. We're moving in. Awaiting orders. Our walker move back. Artillery start to fire. On my way. Let's keep those numbers down. Choose your reinforcements. Moving to that position. And then Inputting always orders. in the back. I'll bring in and some. There we go. I'll bring in some rocket after. troops as well. That way we can kill the building a little bit faster. You go ahead and fall back. Going. Artillery. Attack, Doing great, target. keeping their numbers down. Attack, we have a whole target. new wave coming in. Hold your position. What happened? Ah! Camera freak out. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. It's eating the rounds for us. Order's been given. Artillery's firing off. Uh, we have not done enough damage. Their base is so strong. But the idea that like the Venator isn't meant to be this this mid to close range brawler and that they were misusing it during the war uh, kind of just ignores Reporting the it. idea that they had something else in, in mind and that the Venator wasn't built for it. Keep in mind, right? The Providence costs almost seven times as much to build as a Venator by the lore, right? Seven times as much. So for every one Providence, there should be at least just about, it's just under seven Venators. That many Venators is about six times as many Starfighters and a really decent amount of anti-capital ship. Also, it's not like they're unarmored. A Venator has more armor than a Dreadnought does. By lore, and has less crew requirement, which is one of the big weaknesses. Oh, look at those grenades going off. One of the big weaknesses of the Dreadnought. Uh, in in the lore, is that it, it took way too many personnel to keep Bomber those things, those old ships reporting. running. They sure as hell were going to use the um, the acclimator. That was a ground transport ship. Even the refit, still not great at it. It was meant to transport ground force. Awaiting order. So there was no real like replacement ship that they could mass produce. They could do the job better than the Venator being that kind of front line. Why are you guys shelling the crap out of this base for me? Attacking. You may file when ready. Hey, he's just not trying. Hey, he's stuck. I think he's stuck. Yeah, there he goes. Just a little slow. But keep that in mind when you're complaining about the Republic and how they used him. Planetary control achieved. over in Shack Chat on the Discord. <laughs> Removing corruption. Uh, all right, here we go. Uh, corruption removal. So our operative 
Gaius the operative has made it. You know, Iridonia. If I took Iridonia, we could hook up to Jaeger Miner and I could start collecting my Venator battle group. Hmm. Hmm. One of the things that I do love that we see in... Oh man, Kothor, are you making me bank right now? I'm really happy about that. Can I make that any better? No, I think I've maxed you out. Okay. Uh, speaking of maxing out, yes. We need to get... Uh, da -da 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 -da. Where's our world with the... I was talking about it earlier. Um, oh, this one. There it is. We need to get there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's get some time to go by. I need to get paid, and we're going to invest in it, Seiko Miner, which means it's probably going to come under attack. As soon as there is a, a route from which the Rebels or the Black Sun can make it, they're going to go after this world. Because they go after high credit value worlds. But they're probably going to go after this one. Uh, which means I should probably send over ground forces as soon as they are available to help um, reinforce this region. Constructing unit. As I spend my <laughs> another 2,000 on fun ground forces. Let's get some more ties in there. I may regret the TIE Fighters. Uh, Vader, we need to move quickly because they have built a Rep space trail. station here. And no, they have not. Though it's, it seems like they have. There's a, there is a dot there. Something is up. We'll put a... We'll put something that we can replace fairly easily. Yeah, let's put a, let's put an Aquintans. As you wish. The front of the fleet and go poke this. And then when this battle is over, Tactical battle maybe even before we do a ground invasion, we'll move a probe over to Roche Asteroids and see if we can pick up anything there. See what awaits us. Because it would be really funny to find a wheel unguarded and take it. I, kinda, I want the wheel more than I want this planet. <laughs> this planet is like properly invested capital shipyard. With two Golan platforms, no less. Which, by the way, how much are you guys running these days? Upkeep. Uh, I wish I could read the actual. This is a, this is a one or a two. One. It's a Golan one. Upkeep at a Golan one's only forty-five credits. Wow. High initial investment, but low overall. I can get behind that. Let me put some more Golan ones around. Keep the enemy busy. I I like the mental exercise of of trying to think through. Like, okay, so they really thought about this. Whoever balanced out the CIS versus the Republic fleets, like there was a lot of effort and thought behind making yes, them sir. feel unique and different. At once, come on. Uh, and, and the idea that like, you know, the Republic was always on the back foot at the beginning of the war. They didn't even know they had an army at the start of the war. And then it was surprise, clones, which is ridiculous. And I, and I love it. To start pumping out those Venators, these battle carriers. And then what, what, Head cannon, the ISD, right, is the overcorrection of what people thought the issues were with the Choose your reinforcements. with the Venator. It's a carrier. It's not very good front line. It doesn't have the firepower necessary to fight something like a Providence by itself. Of course it doesn't. It's not supposed to. Combat maneuvers initiated. All right, we're dropping out of hyperspace. For the glory of the Empire. Order confirmed. As you the Imperial fleet has arrived. Our Quitton's crews are ready. With pleasure, sir. Start moving up. What is it, General? Uh, which version are you? With V-wings, right? Yeah. There was a lot of recommendation of like, check, you should get the the the, sh the starfighter upgrade, and then start doing refits on all your starfighters. Start getting tie interceptors. Um. I think the I even think the acclimator gets a refit, so it gets Tie Fighters instead of our instead of um, V Wings. Squadron v Wings and we're going in. And arcs. I, I don't know if replacing the arc is navigating. actually a good thing. Because what would be what is the Bomber Imperials Squadron version reporting. of a dedicated recon? Like the troll fighter, here. like the Ark. What, what is the replacement for this? 
there's probably some like little known uh let's not, not go in first actually you're good you're good the missile launchers are the primary target but engage 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 yes sir combat maneuvers initiated rest of the fleet just move up behind what is our next and then let's get our starfighters up there what is sir an invader yes. we're gonna need you you guys hold your position i will have you move momentarily that's looking pretty good both your cannons your weapon systems are ready to go they've got an angle we're getting so far all right bombers we're causing trouble let's get the arc out of there ah, yeah nothing is coming to mind right now on what the data dedicated like hyperspace recon with long range sensors. I'm, I'm sure there's some kind of like time bomber modified variant that runs around with like scanners on it or something instead of proton bombs. But it doesn't come to mind. And there are ships that could do it, but they're always the like, this was in the lore uh, in one book and they only made like 20 of them. <laughs> The Rebels have one, but it's just a refit. Y-Wing. Yeah, it's the long probe Y-Wing, which loses its bomb capabilities. Ah! Who did this? Why? Why are you like this? Oh, I can't even drop. Combat drop. Vader, 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 help. We're being chased by arcs, and we're taking fire from a space station. Run. Run. Oh, he didn't make it. Oh, brutal. My poor, poor Ah Quintons. Imperial Light Cruiser, because nobody wanted to say the name. I love that Squadrons was like, meh, <laughs> I don't want to bother. <laughs> so every time you see a reference to that thing, it's just Imperial Light Cruiser. <laughs> uh, too funny, too funny. There's an IPV in there and it's not mine. Talk about one ugly ship. I like the model that they use in this, but it's still one of your All right, let's bring in all of the ties. It's like the entire Imperial freighter fleet showed up with one million TIE fighters. We're all just sitting there. What are we staring at? What are we shooting at? Who's there? What's happening? Uh, there are Eddie cruisers. Hi, oh, you're not a cruiser. You're a target. Get in there. You're not even full tie tie fighter wings. And yet there's a million of them. I guess I could send you guys in too. Attacking. There are enough. We're of having you. difficulty tracking them. Yes, come on. Sir. Let's go. Imperial missile destroyer. Missiles away! We're really, really, really crap at killing small Corvette ships at the moment. Like the fleet has nothing for it. Funny enough, I bet you, actually, I bet you the Brute would be half decent in killing a Corvette because it's got a heavy laser on it. It's got two heavy lasers on it. Heavy laser making an ideal choice to take on larger targets. The heavy lasers are mounted on the droid control turret. Yeah, but how am I going to get a droid brute, a dedicated droid brute area? Victory is ours, man. I don't know if there, I don't know if there is one. So in this version, and you guys can let me know in the comments if you're a bit farther in your own Imperial campaign. Um, in this version, they, they got rid of all the variations of the, like the, like the little Gazanti, right? You get the tie and you get the, and get the bomber. And the reason they did that is because the M, the, the AI would overproduce them. Because it looks at them and it doesn't see, you know, different versions of the same ship. Uh, it sees them as completely different ships. So it builds a crap ton of them. So you end up with a huge fighter fleets um, that the AI is building instead of like the cool ships that they should be building to get a better mix. So they changed it. And that's why we don't have as many um, dedicated tiny carriers. And I wonder, oh, oh, they do have a brute version. They do have the brute version. We might, we might do that. I might pick that up. Get like four of those dedicated carriers. Hmm. I don't know why Gazantis feel so effective. They shouldn't be. They only have two guns. They have two turrets. 
That's it. That's all they get. Uh, and this actually has them with two light dual laser cannons and two point defense. They have two PDs. How do they have two PDs? Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Let's see what's over at the Roche Asteroid Belt. Upgrade complete. Hey, Tanab, how you doing? Get yourself a outpost. Beginning construction. And I have enough monies. Uh, I need to pick up... What, what was it? I need to pick up the Seiko Miner. Uh, you do have an outpost already. I could go for an outpost. Mark two, but I need to defend you in orbit, not on the ground, because if it, even if they take the orbit, we're going to lose the most important thing, which is going to be our, our mining installations, which aren't finished yet, so we'll wait to put any money into that. Oh, uh, what was the world that we needed? Was it Anshin? Anshin, did you need? You, you had a ground post. Anshin, I might make you a basic infantry training facility. Like, just get you a barracks and get you some... Um, Imperial manufacturing for infantry. Beginning construction. Dig in a little bit there. And then we'll train ground forces to help take like the rest of this back here. Much much worth. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm debating on whether or not we want to scout out the ring. So we can go to the ring from Jakku. And we take over. That's what we're going to scout right there. Come with me. Come with me. We're building up a second fleet. If we can get to Fondor, we can make that fleet properly sized. Corruption has been removed. And we got a mission. Oh, we failed the shipyard hunt. Mm hmm. Take a stealth unit. We have received word from a reliable source. Enemy fleets are moving through this area. Investigate them. Uh, Denon. Take a stealth unit to Denon. Let's pause. Denon. I have plenty of operatives. I could send them. The question is, uh, where is this place that you want me to send them? It does not ring a bell. Thankfully, they've got mission indicators now. All right, here we go. This is it. Not far. We'll send an ISB agent over immediately. That should still work, Departure I think. Back to set. Head on over. Wait a minute. We have a... Uh... Yeah, we do. Hey, look at that. We got an old ATTE company on the deck here. I don't think I can make those. I assume that's just like, that's what you got left. Huh. All right, our spies are on the way. Uh, how's Roche looking? Did you make it? He might not actually be there yet. I don't think he's there yet. Again, sir. Or I just will never know until I go there. Even with a even with a probe droid, cannot be detected because of asteroid fields. Oh, mission log. I'm not ready. Updated. All right, so that should be another scout mission next. So we've done that one, and now we're heading to Iridonia. I'll send a different ISB agent, uh, or even what do you guys call it? You guys are called assassin agents. Complete. I will send the assassin agent up there to Iridonia. We do know where they are. There's actually a hero on Iridonia. Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> we can assassinate the hero right before a ground invasion. I'm kind of here for that. Uh, I might gather a fleet. And then you haven't, you haven't arrived yet, right? Oh, you have. So you got a medium defense fleet. Mm, okay. We're not really gonna be able to just walk in there without a proper combat group. But it could be done. And that would free up another ISD, an Acclimator, and a Dreadnought. Oh, and a little bit of artillery support. Nice. But I'd have to cycle the fleet back. Because the only fleet that I could make up here would be a Venator. A Venator, Dreadnought, Carrick. The newest of the ISDs. A little bit of fire support. You need a land. You're my defense unit. And we still have to take Vulpter, which I've forgotten what was there. So we have no idea then what's on the deck there. As you wish, master. 
Hmm. Hmm. That Roche. It'll just be a space battle. Oh, this should be. This should be nothing. This should be super easy for us. Is that TIE Fighter unit done? 62%. I just wanted to test them. And see if they were better than having the officer. Why? Really? The 2M requires... Wow. Ah, there they are. All right. Unit All right. Ordered, ordered, ordered. Vehicle Three groups of rocket bound ATSTs. Because they're one of my favorite ground units. You can just punch your way through most problems. <laughs> Mix it with the grenade launchers, too, and you get the best of both worlds. I'm just going to borrow their credits. Okay. Let's get some more regulars. I'm, I'm sticking with Mission regulars for updated. now. What you got? Recon successful and paid out 1366. Not bad. And we got half of the uh, the fear loss. We're holding on that. We're holding on Jaeger Miner until I feel like the fleet is ready because Jaeger Miner's not going to be a an easy invade. I kind of want to. I kind of want to gamble it. I want to go for Roche because the wheel would be hilarious to take. It's a lot of money there. I might go heavy, heavy armor with this one. Drop the ATAT. Want some pause? We're waiting for the other two platoons to arrive. What do you have on the ground? ATPTs. The rebellion has advanced their tech. Horrifying. The rebellion has advanced its tech level. Hey, we've got um victories here. We can start pumping out at eleven thousand. Hmm. I'm at 19,000 right now. We, oh, we've got our, uh, we've got our fighter capability. We can make the brutes now. I'm putting an order in for two brutes. I'm going to use Coruscant to get our ISD Tech 1. We're doing it. So we can get the Tectors. I think Tectors are ISD Tech 1, unless they've changed it. Okay, do I want to make this invasion? I think I can do it. I have two units of artillery plus an ATAT. -AT. We can. We've got two ATATs. Yeah, let's just go for it. All right, men. The Walker shall. No, we're going to have the support team hit the ground first, and then it'll be Walkers, invasion ATSTs. We're going we're gonna to go hard on this planet. What is this map? Maybe not. Lantilles. Sector capital. This might be a pain in the ass to take. Oh, nah, maybe not. These paths don't look too bad. I fought over this world before. Yeah, I recognize what this. Map. Okay, we're moving. Choose your reinforcements. Acknowledged. Destination set. On my way. Both artillery pieces. On my ATSDs. Way. Odd walkers, support teams, lots of regulars. We are ready to repair you. I'll send one ATSD up. I want to see what they've got on top of the hill up here. Sending an ATSD to scout. What craziness is this? When did I start using unit rolls? Seriously. We're going to move both you walkers up. And a group of regulars to eat all of the problems we're going to run into, because it's probably going to happen. We want to make sure that we see them. Something just exploded. Pod walkers! Let's go. Set up there. Why are all the bunkers on fire already? Scanning area. On the move. Oh, we'll get an extra thousand credits if we capture this. Ready. Scouting area. Let's go. There's something moving. Oh, that thing is moving. How am I going to deal with you? That actually might be a problem. I should have gotten ties. Ready for order. Yeah, let's capture any points that we can. Ready for command. Yes, sir. Awaiting your And then orders. you two should watch each other's backs. Uh, maybe we set up on top of the hill with some anti-air. 
I assume that thing is weak to anti air. Weak ready being relative. Let's spread out in case Always it has AoE. Ready, I should check its main. What's its main cannon? Something else is engaging it. One heavy, a long range ATC. Affirmative. Right away. Moving out. I'm going the whole way. And my teams are orders? reaching the top of the hill. Ready for command. Moving to position. I think we'll stay at the evac site. I'm not convinced we're going to be able to kill this thing. I, I don't know. Maybe the walkers could probably do it. The walkers could probably do it. Your orders, Commander. Complete. I am ready. All right. What is your order? I'm moving the team. You may start up. your approach. I will cover you. We have the ATAT -AT advance and the classic. Affirmative, sir. Moving to coordinates. Yes, Commander. Moving Get you guys to up here. Constructing. Roger that. I want to know that the yes, enemy sir. has tried to move in. Reporting you in. should not be able to cap. And then all of you Clear maintenance guys. I should have put in the walkers. That would have been really funny. Like, I'm still going to. I'm going to split you guys up into one each so you can repair it. Roger that. As you command, you men take the flank. All right, let's secure the bridge across. And I will send a squad to secure the sensor relay down here. Form up. Heading Chicken out. walkers head north. Construction complete. Suppression teams head north. Your squad's already on the way. It's decided to fall back. I'm okay with that. Yes, General. I don't like how out any stragglers. stuck we are. Ready, Move sir. here. What are your orders? On Move our here. Way. Oh, we're gonna have the sensor relay in the rain. That's gonna be a nice advantage. Awaiting orders. I'll be able to seize you, and I'll be able to artillery you. Ready to receive orders. Probably move you guys either. On the way. Yeah, down the hill right and then right down here at the road. Rip squad. I hate guard duty. We need to get the technical team installed. Let's Whoop. go. You turn. I'll pick up one anti-vehicle, one anti-infantry. Not necessarily for this fight, but for the future fights. I like to hold them at the river. They ever invade this place. There's a really good chance uh, this is going to be one of those plans to get invaded a bunch. Because I'm probably not going to be able to keep the space fleet down up here. Uh, we've got contacts. It looks like we've got mercs. Oh, they've even got the shields. <laughs> One of my ATSCs decided they don't like you. I don't like you either. We've secured an abandoned sensor array. Turret constructing. Copy. Oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna lock that down. Yeah, I'm turning this planet into like a fortress. This is gonna be one of those worlds. This game. Complete. This is gonna be one of those worlds where I forget. Oh, there's two factions here. The rebels have set up camp. And they've got ATAPs just hanging out in the city. Interesting. We've also got a small ground force and a heavy turret set up. Oh, do we hurt the respawn capability? No, they've got anti-air. We're better weakening their front line. Ready to receive orders. Drop. Good. That should be okay. Initiate bombing. Oh, shields. Wait, they have flechette. What do they have? Switch flechette. Swap the anti-infantry flechettes to anti-vehicle flechettes, which lower defense of hit vehicles. Following your lead. The FC one. Oh, this must be the um, like the little yeah. Oh yeah, there it is. This is oh, what, what game was that from? The little box launcher. It shoots like micro micro rockets. What are your orders? Shadows of the Empire? No, not Shadows of the Empire. It might have been. Um, all right, our Titan Bombers put off a, a single attack run. There's our bombing run, by the way. That looks pretty good. Your damage wasn't half bad. Standing by. 
Uh, I don't. Construction complete. Turret constructing. Yeah, we're Turret digging. Constructing. And then we're gonna swing you guys south. I have in no interest in fighting the rebels ordinance. on this planet. Keep going. Ready for orders. Keep your eyes they're on not, your scanners. They're not what we're here for. You're gonna make you group one. Pop another scan. Reporting. Walker, come on up. This way. Uh, we are once again firing at these poor. <laughs> hey, don't you shoot that. You stay still for a second so we can use the big cannon on your face. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Flyers on the way. Switch fire. Alright, hold position. Ready to receive your transmission. Yes, sir. Construction complete. He's not coming in. He's not committing, and that's frustrating. Because I want to fight him on my terms, not his. Do I have any reinforcements yet? No. I thought I have a better choice of unit to fight this thing. Alright, let's start moving up. Repairs are looking okay. Copy. I'm a little worried about splash damage. Do not separate. Oh! Oh, you're anti-vehicle like... Okay, now I know what that weapon is. Ready. Yes, Commander. What I really want to get in range is Veers, and I want to use his armor-piercing shot, but we have to yes, get... Sir. We have to get in range, and he doesn't want a piece of this right now. All right, scan. You may begin the bombardment when ready. Bombardment incoming. We'll weaken up the building. Maybe we can just straight up kill it. Listen, Ready? if you don't want to engage yes, us, orders, I'm kind of okay with this. Enemy, we'll chew you to pieces injured. like this. We've landed shots on them. Look at that thing. Losing numbers quickly. I am okay, here we go. Who's better? Come on, Veers. Come on, Veers. Come on, Veers. Fire. fire! Fire the armor-piercing ground. Please fire. Please fire. Yes! <laughs> Just deleted. Uh, Awaiting I think that's supposed to be his like Over there. the big shot that he uses during uh, the invasion of Hoth in the movie, right? He pulls the little targeter down, and and I I, I enjoy that little level of detail. Well done. Always ready, sir. All right, we Scouting. want to avoid the rebel outpost. We have no interest in interfering with their. Order? They have nothing we want. We're not going to waste our time. I will cover. With the destruction of that vehicle, I'm going to put everybody into cover, aka spread out. We're going to attack, move the entire ground force, and we're just going to walk in and kill everything that even looks at us funny. That that's going to be our grand strategy. Here we go. Something about Imperial walkers that are just so creepy. Like crank up that sound effect of them walking a little bit. And then the genius audio design of their weapon system. Fear the butt turret. You can see it. Armor transport ready. As you command. I need to get some more classic ATATs. Yes, the general. little baby one is adorable. Lead. If they were going to introduce the cargo Standing variant by. in Empire War, the one that we see in Rogue One, uh, what would you have it do? In. Right, the one that's got like the back is open. Uh, like what? I don't. There's another name for it too. I don't know what weapon system it has. I've never Attack. looked. But like, what role would it fill? Because it's a very cool model. Okay, we have units coming in with shields only in Star Wars. Are you gonna have energy, energy weapons? Oh no! All forces continue to continue to push forward. Provide necessary backup. Reporting in. Oh, you don't even get any ability. You're literally just like gigantic walker. Break through walls and stomp vehicles. Has anyone ever gotten it close enough to stomp a vehicle? And don't say Luke. That wasn't on purpose. Okay, we left the artillery no, behind. Don't piss off the rebels. Oh, okay. Whatever, you've got them suppressed. It's fine. Get in range. 
Once I know that you're there. Come on, you're almost there. I want you to switch your fire. You may fire when ready. I wonder if armor piercing is better for this. Wait for it. There they are. I mean, it's chunky. Very chunky. Do all the medics actually manage to repair? The battle line. You're not gonna make me fight those rebels, are you? This isn't even their planet. Awaiting your orders. Copy. It seems like even with planets that they may have repaired, uh, done doubles upon maps, they've changed things or added a third faction or maybe just a random change. In this room. The bombing run is prepared. It has not ended the game. That doesn't mean. Reporting. Let's see if they've got another. Any units in the field of theirs? No, literally just the rebellion. Oh. The scan's already gone away. Up oh, the rain stopped. We can see farther. Yes, sir. But I don't want to go into the city On with way, giant walkers. That seems I like a really piss poor plan. Coordinates received. But here's Reporting. what we'll do. Fall out. We'll set up some artillery Move out. so that we can see into the city skyline. Reporting. We'll walk right like Veers in. When he gets shot by the enemy, we'll just delete some grid squares. It'll be fine. Scan. Oh, well, we know they've got you guys here. Come on in. Run. Oh, the artillery killed it already. Commencing bombing run. Oh well. Ready. This is a poor life choice. Uh, I need orders. you, walkers, get in there. On my way. I am ready. What Locking is your order? order? Awaiting orders. Best speed. Oh, good bombing run. Nice. Couple of structures left. Copy. Nothing. Some pod walkers can't take care of. Yes, Commander. Walker moving out. All right, moving area. I copy. Our base is under attack. Really? Reporting. Open I'm not out. even mad. I'm surprised. Give it goes grenades. There we go. On One move. unit down. Scouting Don't area. let him shoot you with that big gun. Let's go. Right away. Let's actually out. use your maneuverability to our advantage. Get behind it. Get behind it. The big gun, not the other big gun. Fall out. They actually have Let's this thing, out. this ridiculous thing, statted in the FFG. And that front cannon is. It's like a Starship's cannon. Uh, in this, it's a heavy, long range laser cannon. This way. Deployable. No, 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 no. Excuse me. Over it's there. a medium Scouting. particle cannon, I'm fairly certain, is that one? Yeah, we're just gonna oh, sit way. behind you until something bigger comes along. Hey! Yes, hey, George. Steve needs a hand. Give him a hand. Will. If only we had the rocket Scouting version. Area. Yes, Commander. What could have been? This feels more like I'm playing Company of Heroes trying to get flank shots on armor. Ready. I was thinking about this earlier yes, today, actually. I was looking at RTSs that I wanted to play, and I was looking at Company Ready Heroes. There's a Star Wars Company Heroes mod. We've covered it on the channel before. Uh, the, every time I think it's canceled orders. and the guy on stopped the working on it, he puts out an update. Like, it'll be a year of nothing. And then I'll be like, oh, man, I wonder what ever happened to that. It must be done. And then, boom, there gets another update. Like, right, let's get Ready, more back up. I see a pod walker. We need that weapon up here. But I was thinking, about, man, I, Relic, what do you guys do? Victory is ours, there we go. We got it. Yeah. Company Heroes 3 was just such a... Uh, it wasn't terrible, but it wasn't great either. How far you've... How far you guys have fallen. I want... I want some classic Relic RTS. Conquered. Anyway, I don't think Relic is the same old company anymore. All right. We are... Clear here. Constructing. I'm going to do something dangerous. I'm going to send it with a victory first. We're just going to see what's up. Just going to see what's up here. 
What? How big of a space station can we get? Tactical battle imminent. Like, how crazy does this planet get? Light, medium, heavy shipyard. Really? Okay. I mean, that's not, that's not bad. That would stop Mandalore from engaging us from this direction. We could dig in here. It's better than to nabs. I'm going to green light the production of a shipyard in this region. IG-88 droid revolution tech. They're already teching up again. Wait, what? Or they've been teching up. Let me know if this is restarted. I think this might have restarted. I feel like they should have been done with that by now. All right, so the Black Sun owned this planet, which is what we figured. But how bad is it? Because if we can own it, space mines. I like the idea that they're mining the asteroid belt and then they're bringing it back to our new shipyards that we've just greenlit. Okay. Choose your reinforcements. Let's bring in the acclimator. I call, babe. Yes, sir. Get that ARC-170, get them out there patrolling. The venerable scout craft. What is our next move? You know what, what what people are gonna say about the question I asked Boarding earlier of like what's the replacement for the arc and the replacement for the arc and I, I'm kind of cool with this is just who needs prime. lots of Ready good detailed long-range scans when you can have a thousand oh, short-range scans and the replacement to the arc is just lots of ties a capital ship just launching ties in every direction it's not great it doesn't have a hyperdrive, but at least you can like just get eye literal eyeballs in every direction. All right, Arc 170. Roger that. Decrease it's to terrible. It sounds like an Imperial plan. It's awful. And I'll send a tie, s the tie squadron viewing Roger. squadron north. Advancing. Let's go. Ch Whoa. Weird map is weird. There's an entire like. Yeah. Affirmative. Go over here. Form up. In route. Ark, you Order fly. Received. Just fly in. We're picking up uh, something purple. I think it's my knock boards. It is. Yeah, it's my knock boards. I copy. It's just a few my knocks. No big deal. The enemy is approaching. That asteroid installation. Ooh. Abandoned repair station has been captured, though. Guess who found it? The Put recon station. unit. Asteroids ahead. Look Which at you being good at your point. job. Yeah, it's one of the very few fighters that actually has extended Water, range of its out. sensors. Right away, moving out. Uh, we do have contact. A large. Oops, I clicked off screen. A large group of Corvettes and Starfighters are closing in on the repair station, and they've managed to dig in with some turbo lasers. We do have a weird opportunity here. We could hyperspace in, like a point blank, and just dive into this fight. Ready. What are your orders? Let's see what else they've got. Copy. I don't need to Heading out. jump in on this too quickly. Looks like Ball those out. R41s are trying to give chase. And if they do, uh, we've got rear turrets, so get wrecked. Let's move out. Let's go. Asteroids ahead. Switch shields. What are they? Front. Are they focused on defending? Roger that. Copy. I copy. Yeah, head on north. Let's see what they've got up there. Ready. Scratch that. You've got to engage. You don't want to run in a straight line. You will die. I copy. Uh, they didn't chase. This way. I'm assuming this is all gravity well, right? Asteroids ahead. Yeah. Switch shields to Get double front. Them. Yeah, and I'm not convinced I could kill Asteroids that that quickly. Ahead. Switch shields to double front. Cool, we won. Ready, sir. Enemies incoming. The big advantage of the Z95 light would be for no concussion missiles. Run. Only the heavy has the hyperdrive. I don't think Awaken the Rebellion actually cares which version it is. I don't think they, they have a difference between the heavy and the light. All right, we're dropping out of hyperspace. The system. Coming around. Now we've got sensors on their fleets. 
I would love to capture that, but I don't think it's going to happen. For the glory of the Empire. For the glory of the Empire. There is a captain who truly believes in... Reporting. The Imperial... Propaganda. Oh, they're running! Rose Asteroid Belt is ours. They are on the move. Bye. Good. Good for us. Easy. Easy capture. I wonder if they have ground forces just chilling in shuttles here. That's why they ran. I don't... Maybe it's just bias that I've seen it happen a couple of times, so I think it's a thing. But a lot of times when you see shuttles, if they have ground forces in orbit, they'll be more likely to run away. Amusement stations were what those were. So, that was just free real estate. I didn't have to do anything for that. System control achieved. Wonderful. Wonderful. We can get a, a station here. We're going to get a shipyard here. I can now send a probe to the wheel to find out what's going on back there. Oh, this is ooh, ah, good progress. Very good progress. So, our battle group... That could be a thing over Biss. Venator, ISD, we've got a Carrick, a few support craft. Uh, our TIE fighter research is done, so we could get our Brutes over there, maybe. I'm actually thinking about taking them... Taking them and collecting up, like, go hit Jetta, maybe, and see if we can take down that um, Mandalorian warship. And then go for, like, the rings of Caffrey. Start hitting the weak spots. There was a little bit of conversation about like, hey, are there any places that say the fleet down near Naboo could hit? Maybe Azamine Station, but not really. I don't think they're... Wait, isn't Ozzel down here? Ozzel, where are you at? Yeah, oh, there's an ISD here. Yeah, Ozzel's down here too. So we combine Ozzel, the Venator, Gazanti. You're a moth, so you don't actually get a starship. You're a income generation increase I might be able to cause problems back here but not very far I think the rebels are basically in every direction yeah Bespin's right there how I would love to begin an early invasion of, of Hoth all right everyone I look forward to reading your comments I like where the campaign is going so far I hope you've been enjoying the intros I'll catch you all in the next one later everybody